We received countless tweets, emails, and calls about our next guest. She is a fearless 17-year-old battling brain cancer. I wanted to meet her, so Courtney Wagner, come on down. Hey, Hi. Courtney. Hi. How you doing? I'm doing very well. Yeah. <laughs> so here at your show, so I'm. <laughs> I know you thought you were just coming to the show. Um, you, it must feel really, really good because you have so many people campaigning. We started seeing all these hashtags and all these people writing signs and uh, wanting you to be on the show. That must make you feel good. Yeah, it was um, a little surprising to see like the thousands of people that liked. Um, my mom's page that she created, and it's, they're all just amazing trying to get me here, and they, and they did it. Yeah. And, um, they did it, we saw it. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe I'm here. <laughs> well, I guess it's, it's nice, because it means a lot to you, because you're a big fan, you watch the I show. I am a huge fan. <laughs> yeah, I know that you read my book when you're in the hospital. I've read three of them, yeah. Uh, you've read all my books, well, thank yeah. you so much. And you have all my swag, you're wearing my stuff, my socks. Yeah. Uh, my, hopefully, my underwear. I'll give you whatever you want what, now that you're here. Um, oh. So you were diagnosed uh, with cancer four years ago? Yep, just four years, about three okay. and a half, four. Just yeah. out of nowhere, you just all of a sudden got the diagnosis. Yeah, it was weird. I was just having headaches, um, and I, with the brain cancer that I have, the type, um, you're supposed to have like seizures and everything, but I didn't, so it was very unusual. Right, and at the time, four years ago, how long did they give you? Um, my prognosis was 18 months. Right, and four years later, here you are smiling yeah. right here. <laughs> I love that I make you happy and that I make you smile because I do think that counts for a lot of things. I think that helps people feel good in many, many ways. Absolutely. And so you're, what did you say to your doctors when they said, because you used to play soccer and everything, right? Yeah, I, I still do uh, play, well, at least I try. Uh -huh. um, but I told my doctors I didn't want cancer to define who I am, and I said, you better fix, you better fix me because I'm not I'm not going to go through this, and I wanted to be a normal kid like everybody else. I didn't want to be known as the cancer, like Cor Courtney who has cancer. So I told them, you better fix me because I need to go play soccer and do whatever else I want. Well, it's that <laughs> attitude that's got you here today, right now. <laughs> so, I mean, I don't think that, that that event can change you and you become a different person. You clearly have been this person all along, but you say that cancer brings the best out of Why do you say that cancer brought the best out of you? Um, I feel like it's made me um, a stronger person, and you have definitely helped through that, and with my community has stuck with me through the, this whole time, and family and friends. It's just been amazing how much people care about me and wanted to help me any any way possible. Well, love is, it, it certainly does show you how many people love you, and love is very healing, obviously. Yep. Um, I know your mom has uh, stayed, she's staying home and taking off work because she has to support you. There's a lot of medical bills. <laughs> Our friends at Shutterfly want to help. Their vision is to make the world a better place by helping people share life's joy, and they agree with me that you're making the world a better place, so they want to give you a check for $15,000. <laughs> favorite soccer team is the uh, the women's U.S. soccer team, right? That's yeah. your favorite sport. They uh, wanted to send you a message, so let's look. Hey, Courtney, we wish we could be there with you. We're in Portugal training for a tournament. We know your story and think you are amazing. Court, your strength and your fighting spirit inspires us. Any team could use someone like you. Thanks, Ellen, so much for having Courtney on your show. We can't wait to see you, Courtney. Keep fighting, buddy. That cool? So they wanted to make you an honorary member, so they sent you this. So you oh have. Oh my God! That is so cool. I know. Isn't that amazing? And they want you and your family to be a special guest at one of their games. So they're giving you tickets and all their swag and anything. Oh my God. Uh, Oh my gosh, I told my mom I wanted this ball for my birthday. Oh, well, you have the ball. You have yeah. anything you want. And by the way, I want you to go shopping in the Ellen shop before you leave. Anything you want, get as much as you want. Oh. It's all on me, okay? Oh. Get anything you want.